like to talk a little bit about the Sherman, the different style, and how to shift them. Uh, this particular model is a step up, but it, with the step up and the step down use the same handle. So you wouldn't be able to tell the difference from the step down or the step up. Now to access the standard gears, the standard range is push forward. The high or low range would be to shift, go through the neutral detent and all the way back would be either your step up or your step down. Next I'd like to show you the Sherman combo. This has a low range, a high range, and a standard range. To access them, here's the uh, shifter. This is the low range pushed all, all the way forward. For the high range, you would come through the neutral detent and then all the way back would be the high range. To access the standard range, you would push to the neutral detent and come out away from the tractor, it would move about three eighths of an inch away from the tractor and then pull back and that would access the uh, standard range. Next I'd like to talk a little bit about the Sherman combo on the later industrial series. This is the handle, unlike the dog leg, because of the arm, you can't have the dog leg handle. So you have a handle that comes out this way. It's basically the same. You would, uh, this is the neutral detent. And, and shifting, if you came out and shifted it back, that would be in standard. That would be the standard range. Shift it back to neutral, the neutral detent, then, then push it in and shift all the way back. And that would be your high range. Pushing the handle forward would be your low range. It's the same thing as the uh, the other combo, just a different uh, style handle. On the next tractor, I'd like to show you, this is in a, a Ford forklift, heavy duty forklift 4000. I'd like to show you the reverser. This is the handle for the reverser on this. And they also use these on loader models. Uh, this is the neutral detent, then forward would be forward, and moving it back through the neutral detent would be reverse. This would give you four forward gears and four reverse gears. Okay, thanks for watching.